The Iowa Hawkeyes pick up an impressive win, 6-1 to one over the 13th ranked team in the country, Purdue. They're just spellbound by Sasha Keeble. He was terrific, just a freshman, and now Coach can't ask for much more than what he did this, this no. evening. <laughs> it really warms my heart to see that all the freshmen do so well tonight. Jack Dumb, the coach here at Iowa, he has put the, the youngsters in, said, do your best. You're the hope for my future, for our future. And they did marvelously, especially Z Zasha Kieber. Kieber. <laughs> Let's take a look at some of the scoring we saw today. For the Iowa Hawkeyes, they uh, scored the bulk of their runs in inning number four. It was a line drive single by Jacob Yasinich. That scored the game's first run. Very next batter, Chet Zizi, a three-run home run. Hawkeyes really not looking back after that. They were up four to nothing. They would make the lead five to one later on. The one run scored by Purdue coming right here. This is Stephen Talbot. That would be the only run scored on the day for Purdue. Iowa Hawkeyes would tack on a run here when the fielder's choice is not fielded cleanly. The catcher Plowecki trying to make a tag, just can't hang on. And another insurance run would come across in the bottom of the eighth inning. Here a single by Eric Toole down the third base line. That plates Anthony Torres. And there you have all the scoring you would need. The Iowa Hawkeyes riding Sasha Keeble. They pick up an important win with all those freshmen against a great Purdue Boilermaker team. Oh, yes. And Purdue is battling right down to the end. And they are a good team. They're a fearsome offensive team. But the young freshman tamed them. He had great command with three pitches, a good fastball, an occasional changeup, and then a breaking ball. Looked like a slurve or a slider, but it was perfectly uh, in command. So one more game tomorrow, and Iowa's season is over. Purdue, they still have postseason baseball ahead. They have the number one seed for the Big Ten tournament when it starts on Wednesday down in Columbus, Ohio.